Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle are both raising young children, albeit on other sides of the world. But how different are their parenting styles? Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton, whether a future queen or a typical American mother, every mother has her own parenting methods. Royal parenting has been a matter of intrigue throughout history. Parenting customs and practices have changed radically in the past decades for the royal family. While protocol and privacy once took priority, with royal women giving birth at the home, not the wishes of individual mothers are catered to in a greater way. However, now, more than ever, royal mums have a choice when it comes to raising their children. An expert analyzed the parenting styles of a new generation of high-profile mums, Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle. After marrying Prince William in 2011 in a lavish ceremony in Westminster Abbey, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge have since welcomed three children. Prince George, 8, is an older brother to Princess Charlotte, 6, and Prince Louis, 3. Kate Middleton has been described as a lighthouse mom by one expert. This means she guides the children but lets them head out on their own too. Kate and William, on the other hand, regularly share updates on their three children with the public via their social media. Prince George, 7, and Princess Charlotte, 5, both attend the same school together in Battersea. Parenting expert Sue Atkins said, she seems to have a warm bond with her children. She is known to get on eye level and this behavior shows that their children are their primary focus. Kate was aware that when she married Prince William, she would take on important responsibilities as part of the British royal family. The royal family has around 2,000 official obligations globally every year. Members of the senior royal family devote their lives to the people of the Commonwealth. Their families ensure that their lives are private, while the British throne is in line with Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis. Kate obviously has the pressure of bringing up the future king, as both the Queen and Diana had. But as someone who had a normal childhood very much out of the attention of the public aristocracy, she wants to ensure her children are kept down to earth and grounded. While Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex, married Prince Harry in 2018 and had her first child in 2019, Master Archie. The Sussexes, however, left royal life in early 2020 and moved to North America to raise their children in Montecito, Santa Barbara in California. It is clear the couple are determined to raise Archie with the utmost privacy and very little is known about his care. From afar, it seems that Meghan is a much more protective parent. She wants her children to have an upbringing as much out of the limelight as possible. Meghan also cherishes the value in spending time outdoors and having fun, similar to that of Kate, as can be seen in their chicken coop which they lovingly look after in Los Angeles. Both women have very different kinds of parenting. NPV Magazine is the best source, you will find everything related to your favorite members of British royal family, the latest and fastest news about them. This channel does not seek to prove truths behind the curiosities, theories or events of history. My primary goal is just to entertain people. I wish you see the fun of the news. If you like our videos, please subscribe channel and click the little bell button to receive the latest videos.